They call me Squirrel. What's going on, Squirrel Squad over here on Halo Squirrel Down Under? Unfortunately, uh, I'm here to make another tribute video. Uh, we have lost a very, very um, funny person who I just recently discovered, and I just recently discovered was this funny, uh, Mr. Barry Humphreys. Uh, I know that uh, Barry recently had hip surgery and uh, was having some complications in the hospital from the hip surgery. And, um, you know, when you read an article and it says, you know, we're keeping him comfortable. That's always a shitty thing to read because it usually means we're doing our best to just make sure that they're comfortable until the time comes. So uh, I'm sorry to hear of his passing, and I wanted to uh, do a little piece. And for the first time, I wanted to check out his other persona that I have not had a chance to check out yet. And this is Sir Les Patterson. Gave his wife a dog. So let's take a look at this, and let's check it out. And uh, we'll chat uh, a little bit toward the end. Um, rest easy, my friend. Thank you for all the laughs that, and all the laughs that I'm going to enjoy. Thanks to you, because I recently found you and I laughed my ass off the first time I ever saw you. And, uh, I plan on doing that many more times in the future. And, um, I hope that you rest peacefully, my friend. It's time to watch a little Les Patterson. Good. I'm not hello, 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 little Martin. <laughs> no, listen, I'm no Tom Jones when it comes to singing parties. That was very good, Celeste. I was all over Excellent. the place then, no, pal. No. Look at me. Yeah. <laughs> it's very nice of you to, to join Beautiful. us. And, uh, the Christmas spirit is alive right. and well in Les Patterson tonight. I've, uh, I've been <laughs> getting ready, helping little kids and things. I. I've got my elves busy. I've got a special little elf, a lovely little woman you might enjoy, Thomas. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, she's Scandinavian. Her name is Astrid. Oh, Astrid. It's a Scandinavian name. It means a stride. <laughs> <laughs> Except the, the E is silent, as in, as in rection. It is. <laughs> Astrid. She's from Lapland, and she's a dancer. Are you with me? <laughs> A lap dance. Uh, yeah. uh, beautiful. She's lovely. Anyway. Yeah, they're looking well. I'm feeling well, aren't I? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm looking good. And yeah. if you think I'm looking good, let's hear you say you're looking good, Liz. How am I looking, ladies and gentlemen? No worries. No worries. Now, what about Lady Gwen? Lady Gwen, How my she? wife. Yes. She's very similar to your wife. She never sees me. She never sees me. It's sad. Gwen, she's nice, but she's boring. It's terrible. She could bore an arsehole on a wooden horse, my wife. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean that lovingly. I mean that lovingly. Right. But I bought her a lovely present last Christmas. She could bore an asshole on a wooden horse. Oh, my God. I love that line. I'm totally pulling that line out next time I'm on a live stream. Like, you're so boring, you could bore an asshole on a wooden horse. Wow, that was great. Christmas. This is an idea. Do you know what I gave Gwen? She won't be seeing this. This is not going to Australia, no, is no, it? No, no. My wife, I gave her a dog last Christmas to keep her company. She's as lonely as buggery, my wife. And uh, I bought her this dog, and she called me up a couple of months ago, and she said, Liz, a dog doesn't respond to my whistle anymore. My wife would whistle, the dog would come to her, because she whistles naturally. She's always had a loose denture. <laughs> <laughs> the dog, she said, I'm whistling, the dog hasn't moved. What should I do? I said, go along to the vet. Oh, I better still just go to the chemist and buy some of that stuff in a tube that takes the hair off, a depilatory. Because I said, you better get it because the dog's got hair in it. See, it's that's right, I can't hear you whistling. So you get the cream. So she said, she went to the chemist and he said, well, look, before she could say anything, he said, if you're using it on your legs, plenty of soap and water because it's caustic. And he said, if it's for the armpits, more soap and water. And if you're using it on your face, Lady Patterson, really, you better wash it off quick. She said, well, actually, it's for my schnauzer. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. <laughs> and he said, he said, in that case, he said, don't ride a bike for a fortnight. <laughs> That's what he said. But... <laughs> Well, 
So that's we true story. Well, that's a, that's a good sir. We're now, here in the years of the dog. I'm, I'm, I'm glad that you could you could make it just to join us for a few moments uh, from the sunburnt land. Yeah. Long oh, way well, away. someone had to pick this show up off the ground. <laughs> <laughs> How lovely to be on your show. <laughs> what have you just noticed? <laughs> <now>? <laughs> <laughs> This is a time. This is a Tom, Christmas, this Tom's is, got a bit of competition tonight. This, <laughs> this is a Christmas show. This is a Christmas show, show and I must, I must go. You got my old trousers on, yeah, I think. Two clubs. What fun we've had we've tonight. We've had fun tonight, so let's thank you for joining us. Oh, thank thank you. you all for joining us tonight. We've got one more little bit to do, but it's what been a real delight, Martin. Pleasure. What are you doing, Martin? <laughs> so, Les Patterson. Oh, my goodness. Les Patterson, that was, oh, my gosh. <laughs> When he said schnauzer, oh boy. Did he have a big, uh, he had like a big piece of meat in his trousers, I believe is what she was pointing at. He had something, I mean, I thought it was actually meat, but he had something there to resemble meat in his trousers. Um, what a great, <laughs> I love how he's talking, he's talking about Astrid and he's like, it's a silent E, just like in the word rection. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, well, that was hilarious. Um, I'm glad that uh, this was the time when I decided to finally dip into Les Patterson and check it out for the first time. Uh, just to show that uh, you're going to keep us laughing for years to come. Uh, I appreciate both these characters. I'm going to try to find some just Barry stand-up as well, if I can, if it's out there. But uh, I, uh, I hope everyone got a chance to have a good laugh. And um, I want to just say, uh, I hope you rest easy, my friend. Rest peacefully, sir. Thank you. It's always it's always an honor to have someone to come into this world who dedicates their life to making others happy. That's truly an amazing blessing. Thank you for choosing to share that with all of us. Thank you for choosing to share it with all of us and you know different characters as well, which makes it even more special. So. Barry Humphreys, rest peacefully. Scroll up.